All right, this is the first video in the assembly series. We're going to put the different parts that you've made together. This is about 95% done here. This is what your playground will look like when you put everything together. The only thing I don't have on this are the crayon poles that we're going to put around the top to keep people from walking off uh, if you were to actually build this playground. So this is what the final thing is going to look like. you got your spiral slide, your tunnel slide, your wall climb, and your monkey bars platforms all of this is going to come together today we're going to put together the monkey bar so let's go to ipro new standard assembly and we're going to place the monkey pole or monkey bar in first so monkey bar of course we're going to click twice to place two of them down and then we're going to place the upright monkey bar we're going to place that on the right side. And then we're going to place the upright monkey ladder on the other side. So you've got something like that. Okay? Kind of matched up. This one will go with these three. These three go together right here. One, two, three. And these three go together. All right. So what we do to one, we're basically going to do to the other. So with this first one here, we're going to go to Constrain, and we're going to mate, so we don't have to change anything. We're going to mate the bottom, or excuse me, the top of the upright monkey ladder to the bottom side of the monkey bar. Okay, whichever one you click on first is going to move, so that's why I chose the ladder first. Click Apply. Okay, so now those two faces are joined together. I'll do the same thing back here. Top of the monkey bar. Go to the bottom and make those together. Make sure you hit apply. All right, now we got to even things up. So we're going to come back here to flush. And we're going to say flush the side of the monkey bar to the side of the upright monkey ladder. So that those two faces are even. And again, the same thing back here. Flush this face and this face side to side. Now let's line up the backs. So the back of the monkey bar and the back of the upright monkey ladder. Apply. And then we'll come back here to this one. Back to back. That is under flush. Hit apply. So there's one side completed. Let's go ahead and now mate the other sides. Top the bottom, just like you did on the other side. Apply. Same thing back here. Top, bottom right here. Apply. Now we're going to flush side to side. Apply. And side to side. Apply. And then back to back. Apply, back to back, apply. So now when we close this window out, we have two sets of monkey bars here. So now the only thing we're missing is the bars between them. So we're going to do that by placing the monkey pole computer's frozen up here. There we go. And it crashed. All right, now we're back from the crash here. Now we need to put the monkey poles in. So we're going to place the monkey pole. Let's go back to my playground file here. Monkey pole. And we need 21 of these. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1, So there's 21 bars. All right, now you have to do this to every one of these. It gets a little repetitive, but constrain. We're going to come over here to insert. And we're going to select the second version here, the second solution, align. Now, we point our cursor to the pole, arrow coming out here to the right, 
find a hole up here, and the arrow going out to the right. Press apply. So you want the arrows facing out to the right. So do this for every hole. Apply after every time. Make sure the arrow points out to the right. If you don't, you get the arrow point out the other way, it's going to stick out the other side. So you have to hit cancel and then redo that. Insert align is your solution. Arrow pointing out to the right, arrow pointing out to the right. Now, always click the pole first, otherwise you're going to move the whole set. Just do that for every one of them. get the hang of this you might want to scroll ahead a few seconds in the video because this is pretty much what we're going to be doing right here for the next 15 to 30 seconds uh, didn't hit apply that time The good thing is we don't have to do this every time to the other side. We'll only have to connect about two of them on the other side, and it will match the rest of them up. Almost done here. Yours might look a little bit different than mine because when I uploaded it from the crash, I believe I've got the uprights reversed from what we did earlier in the video. So that's not a big deal though. All right. So we got one side lined up here. All we have to do is match up two of these to the other side. So I'm going to take this middle one here. Arrow coming out to the left. It's the fourth one. So one, two, three, four. Arrow coming out to the left. Apply. And then just pick one of these on the side. So I'm going to take this one on top. To this one on top. Arrows out to the left. And that will line up all of them right there. Now, turn this back around the way you guys are seeing it. That's what you guys are seeing right there. This is your monkey bar assembly. I changed the color of mine here to make them a little darker after this. Because I couldn't see the holes when it was a dark color. So I made it a light. It's totally up to you. Go up here to save, save as, and this is called Monkey Bars Assembly. See, I've already saved this once. So Monkey Bars Assembly. Click save to save it. I'm going to hit cancel so I don't overwrite what I've already done. And that concludes the Monkey Bar Assembly video.